What's up, gang? So I want to talk about the comments that House Sign Renner made, as well as uh, holding people accountable again, because there's no accountability with this team. But before I do that, uh, if you can hit that like, subscribe, and bell icon buttons, it'd be greatly appreciated. It's very helpful for the channel, and it gives me great feedback on the content that I put out and what you guys think, as well as I don't want you to miss out on a single thing that I put out when I put it out. So let's get on to it with this. So first off, Hal Steinbrenner, I do give credit for because he talks more than most owners. Um, and this was actually brought up by Donald on the, who's one of the co-hosts of Pinstripe Chronicles. And I want to give him a shout out because he, he brought this up and this was a great point. So shout out to you, Donald. Thank you for bringing that up. Uh, that's a great point. But he does talk more than, than most owners. Uh, but there were some comments that he made that were very concerning, if you want to put it that way. And the Pinstripe Chronicles on their uh, live stream this morning put this out. And this was a great point, And I'd like to give a shout out to them. Um, but the concerning comments that he made was that he's confused on why the Yankee fans are so angry in of how the season has gone so far, as well as there'll be that everything is fine. Everything is not fine. Let's put it to you that let's put that out there. Now, everything is not fine in the world of the Yankees. You have a team that is struggling to win ball games. At this time last year, we had the best record in the majors with the highest run differential. I don't even think we've cracked the top eight or top ten for run differential. So let's stop gaslighting everyone. Also, when do you hold Boone and Cashman accountable for the stuff that they do? Wrong. Also, to touch on Cashman, Cashman needs to wake up. Brian Cashman refuses to call up Oswald Peraza and Esteban Floreal who are playing their best baseball right now. I don't know why he is so opposed to this. Maybe it's because then they'd have to move Volpe to second and uh, they could deal Torres, and it makes it easier to do that. Now, I'm not saying to get rid of Volpe. I'm saying move him over. And I want to give a shout-out to Jason of 161 River Ave because he put this out as well. Move Volpe to second. It's a better fit for him. Oswald Peraza is our best defensive player in our system from the minors, from the majors to the minors. And he hits and he steals bases. So why not bring him up? Because it's going to make the team better. And that holds, and then you have to admit when you're wrong and that you have to hold yourselves accountable. Come on. Stop gaslighting us. Stop yankifying everyone, as uh, Donald of the Pinstripe Chronicles would say. Stop doing all that. Time to make this team better. Yankee fans deserve better. Brian Cashman, it's time that you hold yourself accountable. I've defended you, and I'm not doing it anymore. I'm done. On this one, I am not defending you. I'm sorry. You need to call up Peraza, and you need to call up Floreal. It is that time. Let me know in the comment section below what you guys think. Let's get into this. I'll talk to you guys next time. Have a great rest of your day.